Why don't you go take a walk around the playground and see if that inspires you, okay? Because if you're having trouble thinking of ideas, go walk around, see if you can think of what physical skill you'd like to test, or maybe something that hasn't been used before for an obstacle. So this is my ninja obstacle design class, and so the purpose of the class is for the students to problem solve and come up with a way to test the skills that people test in ninja obstacle courses. I like to build the courses because they're really creative and I like to create a lot. We design obstacles on our school playground and Jamie runs here. He volunteered to come in and go through with the students while they're on the test and improve side of their obstacle design and really give them some things to think about and let them know how he thinks their obstacles work and give them some questions to consider. So that was making it much harder, right? And then going from here makes it even harder. What if, Eric, come down here. What if you had them spin the other direction? I've never met a real life ninja on American Ninja Warrior, so I just think it's super cool that I get to meet him. It's such a fun thing where I can go, you know, teach children, especially when they're in an environment like this where they're not just thinking about what they're doing, but how they're doing and implications of, okay, I created a course that I think is gonna be fun, but now they actually have to put it into practice. They have to allow other people to try it and deal with, oh, this is too hard. I have to change it and figure it all out, which you know happens to so many kids. Well, I came to Monkey Balls because on the playground, that is my favorite piece of equipment. I knew that like skipping two balls for people would be really hard and not skipping balls would be way too easy because that's just normal monkey balls. I love working with people of all ages, especially the kids who have all this energy and creativity that just want to put it somewhere. I like to do this because it's just really fun and yeah, and you could just learn from your mistakes and learn new things. I love to learn because I think it's interesting to learn new things and you can see things in brand new ways that you've never thought you can see them before. 